ideal lady because she's like you can go ahead and take the video if you want to so her desire she's told me she has two desires one was to go to singapore another one was to get a rhinoplasty done <laughs> <laughs> and she's gone to many places across tamil nadu and she's come here now so our plan is uh, i was just explaining to her the septum is not supportive and hence it looks like a tent that doesn't have the stilts to support so once you give the support then the nose would have a much better form she's not happy about this bulbous tip there's also a dip that's happening there so we're planning what is called as a rhinoplasty with rib harvest is going to be like an augmentative nose job so not only will the nose get a little bit narrowed there but primarily this will get a little pointy and it'll come down because this curvature of the columella is also not very nice and the tip is pointing up so when we do this it also increases the length of the nose a little bit by having a clockwise rotation or a d rotation to the nose this way um a little bit of grafting there osteotomy and maybe a wee bit of alar based work mainly to obliterate or reduce the nasolabial grooving so we would give some amount of tightness in the middle third of the face as well Uh, because there will be augmentation along the radix along the dorsum and you can see when i do this how the skin is getting moved towards the nose and it's getting tightened you can see that so that's a kind of effect we will do with this crease and with the nasolabial grooving when i do the work on the alar base this would also get tucked in a little bit by the stitches that we put on the muscles there all right <laughs> All right so here we are in the premed arena before the before a rhinoplasty surgery uh, she's um, come to us with complaints of a bulbous tip and if you see anything that is very prominent on her face is just her tip her tip is extraordinarily bulbous and that is her only and chief complaint other than that um, in the side parna here she has a mild dorsal hump um the narrowness is quite adequate for her so we are only going to work on the dorsum and the tip uh, she will be requiring a rib graft uh, so that we can give her a nice uh, dorsal projection and a sharper tip procedure should take us around 2 to 2 and 1/2 hours and she should be back here um fine eda solanuma <laughs> okay are you scared nothing nothing ah huh? <laughs> okay but she's a very cheerful patient and uh, she will talk uh, maybe once all her splints are removed post surgery she'll tell us how she's feeling so we're about to start this cosmetic rhinoplasty So you can see the patient's got a bulbous tip. Also observe the angle it's making to the nose, the columellar angle. We're going to make the nose a little bit more projected, increase the length, and also augment the. with this cosmetic rhinoplasty and uh, we're going to show you how she was before so you can see the tip was really bulbous with a lot of augmentation to plasty radix work dorsal work it was a very thick skin and a very large bulbous tip It hasn't really gotten pointy, but we've reduced the fit and made it much more proportional. And that's the basal. Just before. Now.
Okay. Hello everyone. Here we are doing the splint removal for a very difficult mouse. <laughs> She's seen all our YouTube videos, I guess. She knows the words that we're going to say. I was going to say cheerful patient. Um, She's been absolutely wonderful. Super. Thank you. And um, she's always been smiling. Now doesn't complain of any pain or such. Miguel. What am I? Wow. <laughs> Very happy. Um, so, okay, first I will explain in the different views um, how, what all changes have been done. She had a very bulbous tip. She she came with that complaint that I do not like my nose because of just because of the tip. So that is the major work that has been done. Her tip has been corrected. Also her dorsum was very wide. Um, now it's a very narrow dorsum. This looks a little pressed because of the splint. But as the uh, days pass by, this will achieve the normal position. Side of the middle of the part. So if you compare side of if you compare these two views, uh, you can appreciate the bulbous tip which has been reduced. There is a minor tip swelling here, but that will also come down. Here you can see. We have both the asymmetry, uh, we have both the symmetry retained. Uh, the tip still looks like it has a swelling, it will come down. But overall, are you happy? Hmm? Ah. Happy, Ithila? Very, very happy. How was your stay? Ithila, I told you. I told you, 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 I told डॉक्टर्स <laughs> मनुष्य <laughs> 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 ना मूक पड़ेन प्रीत वो इंब ना डिफिकला प्रीत रोम ना कू इन वन दिन आसपड़े यार मूक एड़को पेसाम इवो अलग पड़ा इवर नम्ला पार्क मुड़म अब ना कारण पैन मरमें सेतु ना रोम नंबर एल्में ना रोम तैंस पड़े हनी So doctors were rabbits and sisters of butterflies and mm -hmm. sir is an angel. Mm -hmm. uh, that's the Brahma. Just, Brahma. Sir, Brahma. Brahma. <laughs> 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 nice to hear such <laughs> words. Even the cameraman is laughing behind the lens. Yeah. So now we are going to uh, proceed with the suture removal. Get along. इधर 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 इ